There's an interim policy in one mountain county banning Confederate flags from the courthouse, but flag supporters found their way around that. News 13's Rex Hodge has our continuing coverage from the Western News Center. What did they find? State law, Haywood County leaders are trying to figure out a public display policy for things like the Confederate flag. While they've put a ban in place, another group says state law takes priority. I see both sides. Emma Morris understands the debate over placing small Confederate flags at the Confederate monument in front of the Haywood County Courthouse. I get why they put it there, and then I also see why people would not like the negativity and all that, because it caused a lot of pain. When a complaint surfaced last summer, the county put an interim policy in place banning unofficial displays and buying time to establish a more thorough policy. But flag supporters, like the Southern Legal Resource Center, found a way around the ban, citing state law that allows official government flags, including state flags, to be placed. The flag of the state of Mississippi is appropriate to be displayed at the, Confederate, the Haywood County Confederate Monument on the edge of the courthouse grounds. Uh, we could have uh, all 50 states on the courthouse lawn. We could have uh, international flags all over with no control over. Commissioner Michael Sorrell says county leaders are working on a proposed policy, part of it requiring a month notice before placing any type of symbol at the courthouse. It would also specifically ban the Confederate battle flag. They will know that if they adopt this policy, we, we want them to be very clear that we consider it illegal and unconstitutional and just and unnecessary. We've got uh, an out of the area group that's come in uh, threatening to sue us. Commissioner Sorrell says the Southern Legal Resource Center is pushing county leaders into a corner. We can either uh, walk away from it completely or we can ban everything. It's a debate likely to continue. Residents agreeing the flags are part of our history, but disagreeing on whether they should be in front of the courthouse. No, I agree not, no. This is the United States, this is America. I think that um, people should be able to voice their own opinions and seeing that that is for the Confederate I, I, Britons, I think that they should put it up there. Commissioners will consider the Confederate flag issue again coming up at their meeting on December 17th. Reporting live tonight from the Western News Center, Rex Hodge, News 13.